Hey, what's up, y'all? Welcome to the Quick Tips. And we are in the series of five videos where I'm showing you how I divide my practice time. We are gonna talk about my, the second part of my studies. And if you have missed the other videos, please come back and, and watch it because you need to make sure you are not missing any content, okay? This series has been really great. The feedback is great. And I'm very excited to share with you how I do in my daily basis, all right? And I'm sorry. You know, for for the scenario, I'm not in my studio. I am in Miami right now, in in, the, in Florida, for a conference. I'm playing this whole week here, and but I, I I couldn't miss it. I couldn't like just not record these videos for you. Okay, so let's go. The today's video, we're gonna talk about what I do in my the technique part of my studies, which for me. To be honest, it, it is one of the most important part because here I get to practice my precision. I get to practice my relationship, I would say, put in that way, with the metronome, which is for a drummer, is extremely important. I'm not gonna be able to show you the, the exercises I've been doing. In, in another video, I'll definitely record it more, with more details for y'all. But today I'm gonna, sh I'm gonna tell you what books I have been working on and, and why. And the first one is The New Breed 2 by Gary Chester. Yo, this book has changed my life. Comment here um, below uh, asking for the link and I'm gonna send you in, in your DM like the link for this book and then the other one that I'm gonna talk about here. It is really good that it forces you to use the four parts of your body, you know, at the same time and also you singing, you know, and that that is what has helped even me as a the music director, you know, being able to to play you know, and the drums and also communicate with the with the band without lo losing the, the tempo and going off the grid. This book has helped me a lot and you and it also helps you with your sight reading you know so you can like get two out of one all right and this is not a really really easy book so you have to actually take the time to practice and the other one is called it's about time by fred dinkins dinkins i don't know i'm brazilian sorry this book is amazing this also is like uh um the the theme for it is also helping you develop your, you know, your metronome inside of you, you know? So this, it is, y'all, it is very clear. The day, the week I don't practice enough these exercises, these books, I can tell right away in my playing, it affects 100% on my precision and my, my, my relationship with the metronome on whenever I'm gonna play, you know, in a show on, on a, or in a service. In another video, I'm gonna show you the exercises that I've been doing from these books. It's really, some, some of them is, is, is actually too easy, you know, like it is very easy, but it forces you to play, paying attention to the metronome, and that is great. All right, so that's it. I hope this this quick tips was helpful for you. If you wanna hear more about it, just comment here. Comment also, how, how do you practice your timing? How do you do with the metronome? What is your relationship with the metronome? Comment here and then let's, let's start talking and, and see you next time.